Last year was just a terrible year for so many reasons. Obviously, we had the coronavirus pandemic, which led to virtually no concerts taking place after March of 2020, and it doesn't look like in the early half of 2021 that we're going to have concerts either, but there is light at the end of the tunnel. Fortunately, we have a lot to be thankful for because the vaccine is starting to be distributed, and if we can get it distributed fast enough, then we'll have the ability to see live concerts maybe sometime uh, in the summer and then into the fall. There's a lot to be excited about. We have a lot to be optimistic about. There's certainly no guarantees, but uh, I'm feeling pretty hopeful about this. Now, let's talk about Mudvayne. Before we do, if you're new here, like, subscribe, and leave a comment. The best way to support this show is simply by hitting that subscribe button. And thank you so much. I appreciate all of you who do. And as you can tell, I haven't uploaded a video in a few days. That's because I'm upgrading my system here. I am uh, improving things. And uh, I have a new MacBook that I'm using in the interim while I'm waiting for this tank of a system to get here. So please bear with me. The delays are because I'm improving the show. All right, folks. So Mudvayne. Mudvayne is apparently planning to get back together. There are rumors. Now, this isn't confirmed, but there's been some buzz about this for quite some time that Mudvayne would eventually get back together because they're so revered, because they're so beloved. And, uh, you know, numerous members of Mudvayne in the past have chimed in on this and said they would get back together when the time was right. Chad Gray was asked about this in an interview. But Metal Injection has a new report out that says that there are rumors now circulating that say Mudvayne does have plans to get back together, and I couldn't be more excited. So as you can see on the screen, it says rumor Mudvayne plotting reunion tour, and it says even through touring, uh, even though touring isn't happening at the moment, there are plenty of chess pieces being put into place at the moment that live events can begin. According to a new rumor, one of those chess pieces is a long-awaited Mudvayne reunion. Uh, the source of the rumor is the Facebook page Wolverine Kills. They've posted a lot of touring rumors in the past. It says this rumor should be taken with a grain of salt, but the page did accurately report that Slip, uh, Jay Weinberg was the drummer of Slipknot. Uh, they had leaked dates of Slipknot's big summer tour with Gojira and Behemoth, so they do have a history of getting it right. Uh, so it says, quote, Hearing a lot of Mudvayne reuniting for some touring rumors. That doesn't necessarily mean that we'll get new music, but oh my God, what an opportunity it would be to get to see Mudvayne performing some of those early hits. And again, this is not the only time that this has come up. Mudvayne has spoken about this in the past. Summer 2019, vocalist Chad Gray was asked in an interview about this. He says, we're all good. We all talk. We're cool. Whatever. It just is what it is, man. This is where I have to be right now, referring to his time in Hell Yeah. Uh, this is so monumentally important to not only me personally, but to us as a band. And I think to us as a metal community, a metal family, just to carry on and effing run it till the effing wheels fall off. I'm in. I'll do it for as long as I can do it. I love my guys. I love my band. I love our fans. They're not even fans. They're like family, and it's worldwide. It's just a beautiful thing. Uh, bassist Ryan Martini has said this as well. He says, man, there's always talk about us coming back, which is a good thing. I'm fortunate enough that the thing we've made together still garners some type of interest from our fans and for people who have wanted to see us and never got to. There's still kind of in me like, man, are they going to do it? I don't have the answers on that front, but uh, only it's fun that Mudvayne still is something that people enjoy. But as far as it being a future item, I don't know. Only time will tell. And here's the post from Wolverine Kills talking about hearing those rumors. Now, if Mudvayne got back together, it would be fantastic to see maybe an LD50 tour. I think it was interesting how when they came out with the face paint, there was a lot of comparisons between them and Slipknot. I think they did things a little bit differently. They were sort of just painting their faces. Uh, obviously, Slipknot had masks, but it wasn't as if they were ripping off Slipknot in any way because they were uh, painting their faces and they were working with Clown. They had the co-sign from Clown. And for those of you who don't know, he worked on their first record. It was all love there. And then they sort of took the face paint off. I'd love to see them come back with the face paint. I mean, it would be insane. I've been begging for this for quite some time that we could get that Mudvayne comeback. But I want to know what you guys think. What is your favorite Mudvayne record? Mine is obviously LD50. Let me know in the comments down below. And again, subscribe. Thanks again for joining me today at Rockfeed, and we'll see you all very soon. Maybe, just maybe, you might enjoy one of these clips. 
Join me on Instagram and Spotify for news you may not find here. And if you really want to do me a favor, hit that subscribe button. It's the best way to support.